Uh, why'd you pass it, on Uber? It's, I passed on Uber because <laughs> I, pa I passed on Uber because <laughs> Travis and Garrett. Garrett. So the so the person who obviously everybody knows Travis, the person that came up with the idea for Uber and was a co-founder. The one A to Travis's one B, though Travis was the operator, which makes him the one A based on what we we're talking. But the human being that invented Uber was Garrett Camp. Garrett Camp. This one might hit everybody in this room because it's a younger crowd. Garrett Camp invented Stumble Upon. Oh no! Oh my God! I love Stumble Upon. Mm. Shut what, what up, that? bro. That? You'd hit you. You'd put your interests in. You'd hit randomize, and it'd serve you a website with like I don't know anything doodles or yeah. like wood sculptures or and like rugs. Like came up with getting strangers to pick you up at your house. That's oh right. my God! I love that app because you, you would stumble upon a driver. Do and you, you would love just get cynicism? Into a car with them. Cynicism? Yeah. <laughs> don't use words I don't know. <laughs> don't use so like half of the English dictionary. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's because I'm a I'm new to this country, huh? <laughs> Oh, oh you're not doing God, this shirt. Sure. Turn it into an immigration thing. So I, they, they, I had just, it's actually really Kevin, interesting. Kevin, that hit Kevin at home. He started laughing. I, uh, it's really interesting why I passed on Uber. All cliche things that I try not to do anymore. I, after we started VaynerMedia, wanted to do all sorts of things, but I was always building for my dad. So now I have this new freedom. I'm doing something else. And now I decide to do all sorts of things. I bought a wine social network called Corked. I, I don't know if you guys know what Dribble is. Creative people like Dribble is an incredible site. We I, we had a competitor to it for developers called Forest that I did with Kyle Lindsay and I did Corked. So now I have Vayner, Corked, uh, Forest, and Corked and Forest both failed because I tried to eat too much cake. I tried to do too much, and the people that I had running them. I promised that I could help them too much. They were too green. As I've gotten older, back to operations, why I think I can scale, I'm like, wait a minute. I can be the sprinkles, but I need somebody to build the cake. I can't build the cake for them. And so they were too green. They couldn't get there. And I didn't have the bandwidth between Wine Library and then I wrote Crush It and my whole career changed. So I had too many, fighting on too many fronts. Mm. Because those two things failed as side project businesses and I had just done it, a couple years later when Garrett and Travis decided to do Uber, it was a side project. For them? For them. Oh, and that, that upset it was you. Called, it was called Uber Cab first. And they hired Ryan Graves, the first CEO of Uber, found out about Uber through a tweet I did to share the job listing. <sighs> it's an insane story. <laughs> so so because nice. it was their side hustle and I had done that, number two, it was the least liquid I'd been in a long time because mm. at that point I just bought my first apartment. Timing. Timing. Fuck. Yeah. And so I've, I've learned from that. You know, I really, I tell myself now, I've done really well in NFT. The reason I've done so well with NFTs um, is because I'm betting on jockeys, either the artist or the operator. I was just, and I'm like, I'm done doing mm. anything else and, and that's what's working for me and I'm gonna do that for the rest of my life. I just talked to, to Alex today about the investment that we're looking at and he said, you're bet I said, I like the guy. Uh, uh. He said, so you're betting on the jockey and, and he said, you, and I, lo I and, love that. And I'll tell you what can really work. If you bet on the jockey, especially if they're younger, if you're strategic, they may lose and then you have a chance to actually win on their second thing. They'll get you in early because you were- A lot of kids that are, go, a lot of youngsters that are going into this chapter where you have money to invest. So for the people that are investing right now, talking a little different crowd, the mistake I see a lot is you believe in the jockey, they fail because they're 24 and it's their first rodeo or even 30 or 35 and you don't bet on them on the next thing and that next thing happens. Before Ev Williams, Ev Williams and Jack, but Ev Williams, when Twitter first hit, it was Ev and Jack, not Jack Dorsey. And Ev had just failed with something called Odeo because he was gonna build a podcast platform, but Apple came out. And a lot of people made money with Ev before because Ev's first company was called Blogger, mm. the blogging platform that he mm. sold to Google. But a lot of the people that invested in Odeo didn't invest in Twitter because Odeo failed. Stay bet on a jockey unless they do something that's fraud. Watch how they evolve and keep betting on that jockey because you can make it all back on the third one. Mm. <laughs>